Excellencies, distinguished delegates, ladies and gentlemen, I extend my sincere appreciation to the government and the people of the Netherlands for hosting this Climate Adaption Summit. It is a privilege for me to address you in this summit as the Minister of Environment in Sri Lanka. All of us gathered here today in a common platform for serving this planet and living a health planet for the generation to come. Being a tropical island, Sri Lanka is highly vulnerable to the adverse impact of climate change. Although our greenhouse gas emission contribution to global warming is negligible, Sri Lanka is among the top 10 most vulnerable countries for adverse impacts on climate change for the past three consecutive years as per the Global Climate Risk Index published by the German Watch. During the period of 1990 to 2018, along nearly 7 billion USD recorded damage have been reported due to natural disasters. However, total extent of damage in reality of much greater than this due to unrecorded local events and smaller scale events. Therefore, Sri Lanka focused much on building resilience for vulnerable communities in order to adapt to the adverse impacts of climate change. Nationally determined contribution to the Paris Agreement submitted in 2016 are being updated covering nine vulnerable sectors focusing resilience building for the National Climate Change Adaption Plan of Sri Lanka in being implemented since 2016. Further, we are looking for potential partnership, capacity building, technical and financial assistance to build resilience and also urging to strengthen the adaption fund under the Paris Agreement which is vital for developing countries to improve their capacity to fight against adverse impacts of climate change. Thank you.